Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to cover one of the tool access definition called lead lean. Let me open a tool path here. Uh, in this, uh, it's a very simple part and uh, we are selecting a pattern finishing tool path here. So if you look at that uh, part is very simple so that we can able to learn what is lead and lean actually. So, so the thing is here, uh, we selected the tool, you all know about that. And we had uh, selected a pattern here. So the pattern is uh, this one, the two lines at the edge. And we had set as a drive code. But in the tool axis page, uh, instead of vertical, because we previously studied about vertical, it's a three axis tool path. Now we are going to learn step by step each and individual uh, tool axis. The first step we will uh, start with lead lean. Okay, so lead lean. So in this case, uh, the lead is zero, a lean is zero. Okay, then uh, th there are different uh, mode is available. You can try your own, but I will start with Power Mill 2020 R2. And I'm not going to specify any fixed angle. So I'm not going to touch any of the things, just simply uh, calculate the tool path here. So let us see what happened. So now um, I had not tilted any anything here. It is work like vertical because lead and uh, lean angle is zero, zero. So there will not be any tilting. Let us see the simulation of this one. And uh, if you take the vertical uh, uh, axis, there is no tilting. So you can see that uh, in the machine position, zero and zero, so there is uh, no tilting. So you can see that there is no changes in the angle also, okay? So now what we are going to do is, we will start tilting this uh, tool by using lead angle. Um, for this, I'm just going to uh, copy the tool path. So here, uh, if you go to the settings, tool axis page, so let me start with lead actually, okay? So what is wind by lead? So I give 20 degree angle, recalculate the tool path, okay? So I'm going to uh, simulate this one. Okay, let's uh, recall that uh, tool position. Okay, so slow down this one. So now you can see the tool is tilted in a 20 degree angle here. You can see that, I just stop this one. You can see it's, uh, it is start from 90 degrees tilted to 70 degree minus 20, something like that. And uh, if you look at from the front, so it is exactly tilted 20 degree from the vertical. At the same time, you can able to see the tool is traveling along the tool, uh, tool path actually. So if it is moving this one, the tool is tilted along the path actually. So not away from the path. Okay, so when you give the lead, the tool will tilt along the path actually. So let me, uh, so when it comes to this way, the tool is tilted here. So let us see the other way also, how it is going to tilt because it is always stick to the 20 degree angle. So when it moves to here, again, it tilted 20 degree angle, but other way, because the traveling is in opposite direction to the previous one, but it tilt, in the same uh, uh, same line, actually, it's tilted 20 degree from the vertical exactly. No, there is no sideways tilting. Okay, so let me uh, again. I will uh, copy this tool path. So uh, what I'm going to take is uh, this time I will change this tool axis. Now uh, limit put lead as zero and uh, put lean as 20 degree, and I calculate it that one with that angle, come back to here. So now again, I if I simulate from start, now you can see the tool is tilted away from that flow actually, the uh, direction of travel line. So previously it uh, tilted in the same line, but it is traveling now away from the tra uh, traveling of the tool path actually. So this is the difference between lead and lean actually. So how you want to tilt, whether you want to tilt the tool 
in the same direction of travel or away from the direction of travel. So that's a two different path. Let me uh, show you one more tool path. Okay, so go to the settings now in the tool path page, tool axis. So I took 20 degree lead and 20 degree in lean actually. Calculate. Now see this one. Okay, so it tilt in the both ways actually. It's tilted in the along x and uh, away from x actually. So in the direction of tool path, you can say actually. So that's what lead and lean. It's a very simple uh, tool tilting method. Consider always uh, from the vertical, the degree will be considered actually. So if you look at the um, tool axis, you can see that uh, how it is tilted here actually. Okay. So uh, from the this one, you can see it is tilted either way in the top and in the this one. Okay, in the next example of the video, we will see where you are going to use this lead lean functionality. Thanks. Bye.